Today I'm going to be showing you all of the unique rare weapons you can get from vendors across all of Starfield. These are items you can find at stores in every playthrough you do regardless of level or New Game Plus. We are going to start at the Red Devil's secret base which is located on Mars and can be accessed through the UC Vanguard storyline. Here you will find Lieutenant Galter Azevedo, or maybe it's Azevedo. Lo pronuncio correctamente? Uh, si, uh, correcto. I probably butchered that pronunciation, but he sells the Reckless Bombardment, which is a heavy grenade launcher, as well as the Vampire's Gift, which is a rifle that's modded more like a burst fire SMG and is currently one of my favorite items to use. Next we are going to the Key, which is the pirate base located in the Crick system and can be accessed through the Crimson Fleet storyline. Here you will find Aludra, who sells the Pirate Legend, which is a drum mag modded rifle, the Feather, which is a lightweight tombstone rifle, and the Fury, which is a drum mag AK Old Earth rifle. Still on the key and just down the hallway, you will find Zuri, who sells the Hunter Wolf Long Range Burst Fire Rifle, as well as the Power Beat, which is a high powered SMG with a drum mag. Next, we have the Trader, which is a merchant that can be randomly found in a New Game Plus playthrough. She sells the Avatar High Powered Sniper Rifle, as well as the Last Breath, which is another sniper rifle with penetrator rounds and stabilizing perks. She also sells the Reflection, which is a particle beam rifle with increased range and annihilator rounds. Next, we are going to Aquila City in the Cheyenne system, and our first stop is Loretto Firearms. Here you can obtain the Head Ranger, which is a 50 caliber long range lawgiver rifle with a recon scope, and you can pick up the Prime, which is a comically large long range Razorback pistol that looks like it might just break both your wrists if you try and shoot it. The next stop in Aquila City is Roland Arms, where you can pick up the Elegance, which is a high powered suppressed pistol, as well as the Zapper pistol, which is another one of my favorites that can be rapid fired and shoots arc rounds that electrocutes and slows enemies. Now we are headed to Neon City in the Volley system. In the lobby of Ryujin Industries, under the big Arboron sign, you'll find the surprisingly simple and unimaginably named Ken. I'm just Ken. Sorry to all you Kens out there, at least your name is easy to pronounce. Ken sells the Spacer Particle Beam Pistol, which is a Nova Light with Annihilator Rounds. Now back outside on the main strip in Neon, if you head towards Neon Tactical, you'll find this grumpy pirate who has zero customer service skills, but he does sell the Boom Boom High Velocity Mini Shotgun, as well as the Buzz Cut, which is an SMG built rifle with armor piercing rounds. And our final stop is in good old New Atlantis in the Alpha Centauri system. Head to the Commerce District and go into UC Distribution to find the Rapid Shot Fully Automatic Shotgun as well as the Armor Shattering N67 Smart Gun. And that concludes my list. I'd love to know your thoughts on these items, which ones you enjoy using the most. Please let me know in the comments if I missed any that other people should check out. Be sure to like and subscribe if you found this video helpful, and as always, thanks for watching.